Hello everyone, this is the Pressure Prince with another U4 Third Rome Let's Play episode as Russia. So, what are we actually planning to do as Russia? That's like a really good question. Well, we're gonna eat Crimea. We're gonna eat Ottoman stuff here. Obviously, because this looks just bad. We gotta eat Riga. I'm not sure why we haven't eaten it yet. Okay, because a lot of trade league stuff going on so that's actually very annoying and if we leave them alive they can just like dev it up they've already improved 11 times it's really really cool actually that they've done that now however we can get more streltsy which would be a great thing we can raise 64 it's actually a lot would really hurt our bank i think so let's not worry about that too much right now uh in fact we can just probably drop army maintenance because we don't need it so high it's 120 okay we can stack up a little bit more that's fine all right Ottomans are claiming stuff which is far from a good thing for us but we gotta actually start pushing into those guys with hre yeah austria is gonna defend them but austria is so weak because bohemia is even stronger than him like Aust Austria, well, Austria's got 50k, Bohemia's got like 70k ish, so it's not too bad. But Austria's got that much just simply due to the fact that they are the Emperor and that makes them uh, stronger. So, yeah, but not too much. And yeah, I love our power projection because we conquered so much from the Ottomans, it's insane. But that got us in a great position. Anyway gonna send our stacks down there and we totally gotta get rid of all those loans because the loans hurt they will always hurt okay these guys yeah they're taking quite the attrition which i'm perfectly fine with you know now this is a problem because they can just like waltz through my lands because i haven't really worked on well the grasslands here yeah we don't we kind of can get rid of some of our uh forts it's quite okay at this point yeah and some of them are really useless as well really oh this sounds bad but this to the boyers they mm, that's fine we lost some support for strelzy but whatever now here we can probably get that if we wanted to contribution 935 why not we can uh, whatever that's gonna give us some more ducats because now they're higher I love money so yeah with that money I'm gonna do this admin points is also a great thing to do so honestly seek support of the clergy then I'm gonna do a good old recruitment no 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 it doesn't it doesn't actually influence them that much so mm, yeah 100 whatever 100 we'll just do can convert more we just got Crimea so essentially that already gets us into the position where we can win the war and they're not gonna like this because it's gonna get them an extra yeah so that's minus 45 basically so this, I suppose we have to get kill them completely but it's still really stupid like they got nothing all right oh they control Zob Okay. okay, send that there, send that there, and we're good. Really, you guys are actually trying to siege that, that's so nice of you, but you're not gonna get it, so I'm sorry. 92%, 100%, there you go, we can ask for more money, and there you go, they've been eaten. And now we can core all of this land, because that is what we do. And there we go, we're gonna crush that rebellion, because it turned into a rebellion, because we ate them. So, here you go. Maintenance has been dropped. We can start merging that stack together. I'm gonna send those guys in there as well. Yeah, the thing with Russia is that you got a lot of land, so there's a potential for a lot of rebellions. So, yeah, lots of cultures as well. It's not like you can accept all of them. So, you got a lot of development, but really it's not as strong as it looks. Well, it can be, of course, but, you know. I would want to get these guys going, but it's not as easy as it you know, seems. I got like eight at the start of each year, which is not too bad. 
Streltsy are very, very good, so... Because they gain, like, this extra... Fire. Yeah, fire damage uh, bonus plus 10%, so they're actually quite important to use as part of your army. I could push into, like, Ming and stuff, but really, right now... I need... Okay, can purchase an ability. Admin efficiency. Nah. nah, admin efficiency. Yeah, let's go for the admin efficiency. And one thing I could do, actually, is... Wait, where where does it say again where my current, current absolutism is? Yeah, there it is. So what I want to do, actually, is I want to drop it. And to drop it, the one way to do it is you decrease the autonomy. So I'm going to decrease it in pins. It's not in a lot of places where I can do it, though, so... Yeah, so if, if we look at it, yeah, so... Our treatment, increase stability, decrease autonomy, strengthen government... It's quite important, too, but that... Well... Not too bad, actually. It's not like... Yeah, we're kind of overflowing with that anyway, so... It's not too bad, yeah, we can keep doing it. Yeah, we don't want to reduce war exhaustion because it drops that, so... And we can keep strengthening it because we're gonna get a lot. Which we're already at 36, and yeah, we get quite a bit of absolutism each year, but it's not too much. So there you go, okay, local defensiveness, there you go, this is good. It's very good, we can be happy. <clears throat> We do need more money though, and to get more money, we need to invest into some stuff, like... Oh wow, dude, these are really buffing up our country. It's amazing, there you go. Privileges, no, you know what? We can always just do that. It sucks, but that's what we gotta do. Of course, we probably should invest into it again, and admin efficiency is very, very good. So yeah, we're just gonna have to wait a while until, you know, things uh, get better. <clears throat> yeah, this is gonna be good. Alright, religious zeal, that's not bad at all, actually. I'm really happy that we got that then. Of course, I could go for one of these right now, but it's not too important. Or is it, though? Mm. We have no idea. Nine? What? Oh, we need 10%. Oh, we're gonna actually get that soon, so it's not too bad. Oh, of course, we want that. Yeah, we need a lot of money, like, a lot of money. A lot. How's it looking here? 326? Okay, that's not too bad, and we're just pouring more. Is there anything we can do in the local autonomy here? Because I kind of want to decrease autonomy, but sadly I can't, like, the autonomy. It's pretty good in a lot of places, really. I can return provinces as if I would do such a thing. Alright, so next thing we know, we're gonna do that. Don't wanna take that tech, so what I'm gonna do is... I need to start thinking about who I'm gonna attack next. Where's my, where's my true scon with that? 1667, that's a few years off. So probably the next thing we wanna do is... Yeah, we're gonna go against these guys, and I'm gonna call Mink as... Uh, yeah. I could do a separate war against Mink only, actually, and how's it a force like? Level 2 forts. Oh, they actually have some level 6s, which is annoying, especially on the mountains. So I kind of want to deal with Meng as well, and where's my artillery? Oh, I remember. I have no artillery, so what I'm going to do right now. 1, 2, 3. Wait. 1, 2, 3. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. And 
there you go. It's as much as we can make, but we actually need even more. So, there you go. 25. 26, 27, 28. There you go. Okay, now in Crimea, there's like a bit of an issue, which is okay. We can totally deal with it, man. There we go. We're gonna get those guys in there, and we should just barely win because we have no infantry. Oh boy, we cut it real close there. We should have increased our maintenance just slightly. Guys, what are you doing there? You stop sitting there in that useless land. Okay. No, 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 no. Ah, uh, the attrition. Come on. There you go. Okay, that's good. Now our income has increased, which is actually very, very good. I don't want to call a diet here, and I do want to actually recruit a minister, or do I? Write a generalship, and then because of that, we can demand that, and we can... Oh, never mind, we cannot strengthen government more, okay. That's fine, we can however do the construct... Oh, we should have done that guy way earlier, I cannot believe I didn't think of it properly before. Now this stuff here. Um, where is it gonna improve things? Two to five for zero twenty. It could be better, you know, so it's not too bad. Really? Too many military leaders. I didn't even realize it. Oh, right. We don't need those admirals. I'm sorry, but Russia just isn't gonna have that. All right now. Mmm, we could build in Zubstov or whatever, Tsargrad. Alright, we converted Constantinople essentially, which is a great thing to do. Yeah, now... Oh, the burgers are actually quite okay with us, which does change things significantly. It really does. But yeah, Chagatai or Ming. Um, where's our stacks actually? I don't know. You guys, I can send you there. That's fine. Oh, really? No! What have we done? That's not what I should have done. There we go. We fixed it. Okay. Well, that's gonna be an easy fight for us. It's great that we actually moved in right in time. Are there some other rebellions like Persian separatists? Fair enough. Fair enough. Now, how many troops does Ming have? Actually, a fair amount. Okay, Maliuta or Fyodor. Which, okay, we already have Fyodor here, so I mean, that's good. 28k artillery. Well, you know, that's kind of not what we want. Okay, there you go. Okay, one, two. We got 30 artillery. Riches of China. You know what? That's, that's precisely where we want to go, you know? Yeah, the riches of China. This is some uh, pretty good stuff, you know. Go in, take the ch take the Chinese by storm. All right. Little old Ming. Little old Ming. All right, we can definitely take that technology, and we will, and that's gonna put us heavily ahead. I mean. We could be spending into it into developing, but meh. Winged Hussars. There we go, our Winged Hussars. Seems good, man. Seems good. We're gonna do quite well, actually. We got Saxon Infantry, which is honestly quite weird. Uh, lose Inflate? No, we can gain some Patriarch Authority. That's actually quite okay. Where have we sent the... Oh yeah, we need to send these guys there. We need to send more guys here. Korea's insulted me. Wait, what now? Alright, we can now do a holy war. But I'm actually... Oh, we already have it now. So, okay, that, that, then that just makes even more sense. Okay. Alright, now I'm gonna send these guys here. Converted more of them even, which is even better. Of course, there's still... We don't have that much more to convert, actually, which is fine. Alright. Now, having the proper supply limit here, that is the problem. Now, let's look at this. 
Manpower-wise, we got more than Ming, and we do have a fair amount of troops, but... Yeah, e even with... We don't have as many as they do, but... Defensive quantity... Yeah, we should have the quality over them, so... Quite fine with it, you know? We could go for military zeal, but man, I don't want to lose points for nothing, you know? Like, we're not gonna need it. I'm quite sure of it. Okay, we can gain some free Diplo points. Why not? We would want that technology as well. It would actually help. Now, could we embrace anything here? Yeah, we could, but it's like 6k, so... It's very expensive to embrace stuff here. Okay, so there's actually two Ming forts here that we could siege. That would be a big deal. So I'm gonna send my stacks there, and right before I actually go in... I'm gonna do the good old holy war. I'm gonna go in there. You guys go siege that. You guys go siege that. And there you go. It's gonna be real good for us. Let's see how that, where that takes us. Because we actually have quite the advantage in overall. They have like no cab. That's amazing. But they have a lot more artillery than me. Which is perhaps not a great thing for them. Because the Doras are not actually fighting units, you know. Now, Chagatai, I could declare war on them, but which means we could have a separate war going, which is actually just fine. Because we can just eat them, you know? Okay, so we have actually just defeated them there, which is just fine. But they're actually gonna attack me there. Okay, Brandenburg is doing absolutely insane stuff. Okay, we took the siege. Which means we should be able to... Wait, where are you going? ending really okay they're probably gonna try and annoy the hell out of me somewhere you know okay no 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 no. i'm gonna send those dudes to siege there and we can send more people okay wait 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 boris whatever is his name yeah have that guy siege there i know leader i can send him over there because this is too much attrition we don't want to suffer all that attrition, so there you go. Now we have our stacks here, but honestly, I kind of want to stay back because I keep sieging, you know? Alright, so we did actually siege that, which is quite wonderful. Because we did that, like, what I'm going to do next is I'm just going to go in there. I'm going to stop because I don't want the artillery to get in first. And then with these guys, I'm gonna just move on to the next province, and this should be an easy victory for us. There we go, it was an easy victory. As predicted, now there's actually a level 6 fort there, and these level 6 forts are... They're quite beasts. But yeah, I know, I... You know what, I actually need to keep these units close by, so... I'm gonna have to use some... What? Fine. Anything for our dear... Whatever. Okay, send our troops there. We can get more Streltsy, but honestly, we have enough troops right now. What? What is this? I didn't even realize that they're doing this stuff to us. Okay. Well, that certainly makes things more annoying to deal with, so I'm gonna try and deal with them. But whoa, I did not even realize. What is going on here? What is going on here? Okay, we lost a lot, as did they though, so... It's not completely the end of the world, so there you go. I did not realize that there was even something going on there. That's really weird, man. Okay, we need that siege there, we just need that siege. I don't care what we do, but we're gonna have to get that siege, you know. Alright, so the seaman guy is gonna be there. We lost Bukhara, of course we did. But... Heresy! No! No, why is there a heresy? Okay, you guys. No, 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 no. Alright. No, 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 no. We need... We got Fyodor Romanov, so... Mm, yeah, we kind of want him here then. Yeah. Because this is where they could trample the clergy. Oh, no. Why does this happen right now? Why, 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 why? Trample the clergy's got 1672. That's actually fine. Yeah, that's fine, even. Well, it could be worse, you know, but it's, it's still absolutely horrible, but 
Okay, we got Turpin, which is a huge deal that we did. I, you know what? Chagatai. Can we can we actually get rid of Chagatai? Because that is a... Why are you guys not there? Oh my god. And, like, these guys here just walk Waltzen into our land? Yeah, that's the problem. Not having the proper forts. Alright, so we did actually... We are gonna siege this. If that's what I'm trying to say. But... Da -da -da. Okay, where's our course? There they are. There's a lot of our cores actually, but I don't think we're gonna be able to get much more actually. Actually, that's quite a bit of overextension, but it isn't enough. Okay, yeah, there it is. 84% over. Really? Only that little. Oh, our guy died, and we got a zero admin guy. Perfect, right? Not really. All right, we can get this guy, which is gonna help. Nope, we actually need to get right on there. Arthur, no, okay, Fyodor Romanov. No, 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 what is this, what is this, what is this? No, 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 no. Where are you, Fyodor Romanov? He's dead! He's dead! Okay, this guy is not too shabby, though, so there you go. Then I'm gonna actually leave him there. We're gonna continue sieging through the rear of him. We're gonna siege that as well, it's not difficult. So yeah, it's looking quite okay right now. I just don't like that they're like doing all this insane stuff. Okay, I'm gonna send those guys there and they're gonna deal with it. Yeah, Chagatai is probably very far behind though. Yeah, so many techs behind, like we're just gonna crush him. But anyway, that's enough for now. Thank you all for watching. If you can comment, subscribe, follow me on social media. See you all next time.